Hey guys, so I purchased this remote control cockroach on the internet and I was immediately let down. Um, it came in the mail and I put the batteries in, I turned it on, and I was immediately disappointed because what otherwise looks like something that I might be able to scare someone with is ruined by this uh, set of lights that plays when you turn it on and that warns people, hey, this is a toy. You know, I can uh, drive it around pretty well. Looks like I, I could scare somebody with it, if not for those flashing red and blue lights. And we're going to get rid of those lights so that we can actually scare somebody. So after loosening all the screws, I found out that the one that I needed to loosen was just the one right at the mouth of the cockroach right there and that one released this hatch and this LED light right there that's what we're going for that's the thing that uh, we really need to uh, stop and what I'm going to do is take some paint and cover that LED with black paint so that the light cannot get out of it because we don't want to snip any wires because we don't know if the circuit requires that the light still works you know in order for the rest of it to work so I'm just going to paint over that LED with some black paint so here we go grab some black paint here and I'm just gonna cover this in some acrylic black paint now I could remove this black paint later if I wanted to uh, it would pretty much chip right off if I wanted because I'm just using acrylic paint right we're just going to douse that entire LED and now we're going to see if when I turn it on if that thing blinks so we can see where there's still holes in the paint we're still got to get it there's one, some on this side right here some on that tip right there we just want to get this thing completely covered so that none of that light is getting out none of it can't be having any of that all right a uh, little bit towards the the back there and I think we've done it that's good enough we'll let this dry and uh, We'll let it dry overnight, then we'll put it all back together, and we'll see what we got. Okay, it's one day later, and the paint has dried. And if we turn the cockroach on, you can see that there's a little bit of a spot where you can see the light, right? But it's a lot less bright than before. So, I think I'm going to touch it up with a, another little spot of paint on that spot before putting it all back together. Alright, that ought to do it. And we're going to put it back together. And now we have the finished product. A scary looking remote control cockroach that can jump out of a little crack or crevice at somebody and not have flashing lights telling them, hey, this is a fake cockroach. This will actually pass for about two seconds and get me that scare that I'm looking for.